Hey, good morning everybody and welcome back to the Lake District and welcome back to a really beautiful sunny day. Just driving up through the Lake District there, it was gorgeous. Lots of inversion, lots of little patches of mist. Stunning. And it's beautiful here as well. This is Buttermere. Um, and the route we're doing today, as you can probably tell, is up to Haystacks. But we're not going up straight up to Haystacks from Gatesgarth or anywhere else like that. We're going to incorporate a little bit of Fleetwith Pike action. Uh, so we're going to go up Fleetwith Edge, up the nose as they call it. Up to the top of there, I think we're probably going to check out Harness to Crag. And then bomb it over to Dubs and Warn Scale. And then round to, um, to Haystacks where we'll have some fodder probably and uh, just enjoy these views i mean this is a real treat was not expecting the, the day to be like today i thought it was going to be just kind of wall-to-wall -wall sunshine no clouds a bit rubbish for, for photographs really but i think it it's looking fairly promising nice little patches of light so we'll see it's looking nice up towards high style so um i think what i'll do is i'll just push on up and uh, just keep checking those views behind because as you get further up, you start to see Crummock and Lowe's Water beyond Buttermere. And then obviously beyond that, you can see Scotland, which is nice. So I'll keep doing that and uh, I'll see you a bit further up. <laughs> We've just gone past the little white cross there. It's in a bit of a memorial to someone called Fanny Mercer. I don't know who Fanny Mercer is, but I'm sure she was a great nice lass. Must have fallen off one of these crags, I guess. Right, I've just noticed a massive group of people coming up behind me. I have to put my foot down, power up the edge but not forgetting to look back. Right, I'll see you a bit further up. Look at these guys. Here it is. <laughs> Cut more up there. So this bit here really kind of proves my point about what I was saying a bit further down. You've got to stop and you've got to look back because that's one of the finest views in the lakes and we'll get that at the top of Fleetwood Pike but you don't want to kind of wait until you get there because you're going to miss all sorts of stuff. Cloud formations, little patches of light that you might not see when you get to the top. So keep checking your six. And that over there, right across the valley, is Haystacks. Really imposing looking crags. I'm going to get my head down now and get up this. So I'll see a bit further.
right, top of Fleetwood Pike, pretty special. I've just dropped off the summit because a massive crowd just turned up, so uh, let's drop down a little bit. And I'm um, kind of glad I did because it's absolutely gorgeous here. Look at this dropping right down at the worn scale. I'm just a few weeks late as well because this would have been just all pink, like a carpet of pink a couple of weeks ago probably. So this whole area has been mined for years. There's, I mean, there's quarries all over the place. There's one at Honester. There's a whopping great cavernous hole right beneath our feet right now. Um, and then we've got dubs over there, a bit of a quarry work. So that's where I'm going to go in, in a minute. I'm going to check that out. And then we're going to head down to a scale body, which is down that way. And then slowly but surely just pick our way over to, to Haystacks, which is right there. You've got to admit, that's pretty special. Buttermere, Crummock, loads of water in the background. Just make out the Solway Firth as well. But there's even better views to come. Let's get on down to Dubs and uh, see what we can see. Dog's fed up. Approaching dubs now. Great jump. Like a gazelle. Good dog. Dubs Hut Mountain Shelter. So we're just going to get across one scale back now. Across the little stepping stones without falling in. it is, after all, Friday the 13th today, so anything can happen. Finn, where have you gone? It's going to step out into the light. Look at this tiny, tiny door. Through. Oh, I need to get a gigantor through. Oh. That wasn't elegant. Oh. Oh. 
How are you doing, you right? Okay. Some of Haystacks is over that way. But I'm just going to pop onto Great Round How. I always walk past here and never go up, so I'm going to have a little bomb up and see what it's like at the top of there. A nice little interesting bump. Let's go and have a look. can't stress enough how important it is to every now and then just venture off the beaten track a little bit because you get nice little treats like this look at it so everybody's on that tourist trail there haystacks down to Warren Scalebeck and over to Honister no one's up here I'll tell you what, on the right day, in the right conditions, that, looking towards haystacks with high crag in the background, would make a really good shot. So it's a pretty impressive view from the top of Great Round How. One that you don't really get when you're down the path. So on the left hand side in the clouds you've got pillar. And then right in the middle is haystacks, that's where we're going. And the right hand side, that pointy bit, is High Crag, which then goes up onto High Style. That's a very, very tired dog. All right, that was Great Round How, pretty good. I like it. Be uh, not a bad spot to camp as well, actually, thinking about it. Nice and quiet. I'm absolutely starving. I could eat. I could eat a scabby dog. <laughs> That's you, Finn. So I'll see you further along the path. Alrighty. Let's get across here. Hiya. Yeah. <laughs> so that is Black Beck. And Black Beck Tan. It's a fantastic little area this. Just so many photographic opportunities. It's almost too much to bear. <laughs> Look at that down there. Hi. Right. The, the other little jack over there, yeah. She is a parson, yeah. Oh. They were kind of getting on all right for a minute and then I don't know what happened. <laughs> Thanks, bye. Come on in. Look at that. Just ridiculously gorgeous, isn't it? Look at it. Hi. Right. Hi. Hi. Right. Hi. Hi. Thank you. Oh, a little doggy. Does yours go three times as far as you do as well? Um, probably not as much as yours. <laughs> she kind of gets to a point where she's like, I'm done now, let's go home. <laughs> cool. It's a busy day. <laughs> so just over here is an ornament tan. And then it's not far to the top. Buddy time.
summit of Hestax. Just pop over to the proper summit. It's just a massive volcanic rock up here. It's a wonderful place. Okay. Go. Go on. That's it, good dog. Up, up, up. There you go. Drinking fin. chance Finn. <laughs> mm. Cheers. Perfect. So this was Wainwright's favourite fell. I kind of get why, I mean look at that view, it's absolutely stunning. And apparently what his ashes um, sprinkling all over the fell so <sighs> it's like little bits of Wainwright all over the place. a little summit. Let's get down here. Hey behind me Finn. Finn? Where are you? Finn? Come on, this way. Cheeky. Okay. What I want to go and do Check out what summits we've got on the other side here. Let's go and have a look. Now this town has no name. So call it what you want. South from the summit of Haystacks, we can see Green Gable, Great Gable, Broad Crag, and Kirk Fell. All right, looking down Ennerdale Valley back towards the Irish Sea, you can see Ennerdale Water right at the very end there, and above that is Crag Fell, and this big black mass on the left hand side that is Pillar. Beautiful. Ready to go? Okay, should we go? All right, just heading over to Scarth Gap. So I'm dropping down off the summit, and Scarth Gap is kind of that whole Scarth Gap pass. Is the bit between Haystacks and High Crag. Just be careful here. Be careful, Finny. And then from there, I'll bomb it down to Peggy's Bridge got something in my boot. It is driving me nuts. I should really get it out, but <laughs> I can't be bothered stopping. Look at that. I think I might have to stop, you know, and take my boot off. It's no good. It's going to rub all the way down. So I'll do that. And uh, I'll catch up with you probably beyond um, Scarth Gap on the way down somewhere. I've seen a minute. It's just starting to get to that point of the day that I absolutely love. It's not quite golden hour, but it's it's that little bit before it. Everything's gone quiet, less people around.
All right, back in the valley. Look at that. Whew. Gorgeous, high style that is. Beautiful. So I'm just going down the track towards uh, Gates Garth Farm. Got Buttermere just over here. And the entire route that we've done today, fleet with pike, and then all the way around to Haystacks. Just incredible. I mean, you can see one scale bet coming down there as well. Beautiful. So I think just an outstanding day in the Lake District. It's, that is, I think, one of the finest routes you can do with just breathtaking views in every single direction all day. It, I mean, you're spoilt for it. So if you've not done it, you've got to do it. Fleet with edge, round the haystacks, get it done. <laughs> and if you have done it, do it again. I bet you've missed it. <laughs> anyway, enough waffling. <clears throat> I'm going to crack on now. I'm hoping the ice cream van's open here. I'm going to go and get an ice cream. So if you've liked the video and you like this route, which is in the description, by the way, please give us a thumbs up. <clears throat> and uh, please subscribe as well. That'd be really great. Thank you. And uh, until the next one, we bid you farewell. See ya. Finn, it's not a toy. Hello, cow. How you doing? Oh, you're gorgeous, aren't you? You're a lovely cow. Yeah. <laughs> Go on, then, Finn. Good dog. <laughs>